same thing again, and Connor was, Connors was there. Two things were different, Pat. Connor's approach shot was deeper, and of course he was looking for the cross court, and Borg's cross court shot was not quite as low. So the score is deuce now. This videotaped earlier. Another deep approach. That shot just barely missed by Borg. No question that it was out. Neither player argued about it at all. And now it's match point for the third time for Jimmy Connors. Imagine the pressure, Pat, that these players are under out there. A major title. There's one of those fine serves you mentioned earlier. Four got it back to Deuce. Three match points gone down the tube. Another hard approach by Connors off the one-hander. A solid volley cross court. Watch how Connors closes. Really punched that volley. Borg couldn't run it down, and Borg is quick. Now it's Number match four. point again. That time I thought was really Jimmy's best chance because he likes to hit those passing shots. Borg is not the best volleyer in the game. So it's back to Deuce. Another deep approach. And a terrific touch drop volley by Connors. It was hard to tell from that angle, but the forehand that Borg hits was hit with a lot of spin. It was dropping very quickly. Connors closed in and just dropped it over. And it's match point number five coming up. Got to be wondering now if he's going to be able to do it. Out. And deuce again. And that two-hander missed by eight or ten feet over the baseline. There's Pancho Segura. Probably had a couple gray hairs, old Sneaky's head watching his protege. <laughs> and match point number six. And again to our viewers, the women's finals has not started yet. They're warming up, so you're not missing any of the live action. That's going to be Gulagong against Everett. There it is, on the sixth match point, Bjorn Borg surrenders to the number one seed, Jimmy Connors, 7-5, 7-5, 7-5. A great match. And now we're live.